Hello everyone, I am Nehal from WSQ Tech and in this video we have come up with the another Python program and this time in this video we are going to write a Python program in order to just convert the Fahrenheit to Celsius, okay. So we need to convert the temperature uh, given by the user uh, and the user is going to give this te uh, temperature in the Fahrenheit and we just want to convert it into the Celsius, alright. And we are going to even see the vice versa of this, alright. So, I am over here at my pie charm over here and you can just see this problem statement over here, alright. So, uh, the thing over here is that uh, uh, there is a formula, okay. So, in order to just uh, convert the uh, temperature from the Fahrenheit to the Celsius, we have a uh, uh, formula for this is, uh, when a user is going to give this temperature in the Fahrenheit over here, so what we need to do over here is that we need to just do the minus 32. And what we need to do over here is that we need to just divide it by 1.8, all right. So this is the formula in order to just convert it from Fahrenheit to the Celsius and we are just going to apply this formula, all right. So I'm just going to comment this out, okay. So this is our formula over here and what I need to do is I need to ask the user to enter the temperature in the Fahrenheit, all right. So I'm just uh, taking the input over here. So I'm just asking that enter the temperature, okay. So this is going to be the... Uh, input okay so i just want to take the input from the user okay so i'm just asking that enter the temperature in fahrenheit and what i will simply do is i will just store this inside a variable name so i will just say that fahrenheit is equal to and i will do the type conversion over here so i need to mention this as float over here because uh, uh, it can be in the terms of decimal uh, numbers over here so i'm just doing the type uh, casting over here and i'm just making this input as float okay so whatever the user is going to enter, so it can be in, uh, in uh, integer as well or as, as well as it can be in the decimal points. All right. And when I have this, so I just need to apply this formula over here. So what I will simply do is I will just say that the Fahrenheit over here. So this Fahrenheit I need to do is minus 32 over here. Okay. And what I need to do over here is that I just need to divide it by 1.8. All right, and this will just give us the Celsius over here. So I'm just going to say this is a Celsius. All right, and at the end, what I was simply going to do is I'm just going to print that uh, uh, the temperature. Okay, so I'm just going to copy paste this. So the temperature in Celsius is, and after this, I will just mention this Celsius. All right, so this is going to be my uh, final message over here. Okay, now I'm just going to run this thing. So if I just run this thing, so it uh, tells you that enter the temperature in Fahrenheit over here. So I have a table over here. Okay, so you can just see that here uh, there is a Fahrenheit and Celsius. They have given this a uh, nice table over here. So I'm just going to pick up any of the example over here. So say for example, I would just give this Fahrenheit at 71.6. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to come up over here. I'm just going to say 71.6. All right. And as soon as I just enter, so it says that 21.999. You can just see this, okay. So it is 22 over here, okay. And we are getting the exactly the same result over here. So this is how you just convert a, a, a Fahrenheit, okay, the temperature of Fahrenheit into the Celsius over here, okay. Now the next thing over here is that what we are going to do is we are going to see that if a user gives a temperature in the Celsius, so how we are supposed to convert it into the Fahrenheit over here. So what I will simply do over here is that I will just comment this out, okay. And over here, okay, so first I will just write down the formula. So in order to just uh, calculate this uh, temperature into the Fahrenheit over here, so we would be requiring, uh, we, will, we will just ask the user to enter the Celsius, uh, the temperature in Celsius over here. And once I have this thing, what I need to do is I need to multiply that thing by 1.8 over here, okay. And uh, after this, what, you, uh, what I need to do is I need to just do the plus 32 over here. So this is the formula for this, okay. So this will just give you the temperature in the Fahrenheit over here. So I'm just going to use this thing. So what I will simply do is I'm just going to say that input and I just want to ask the user that enter the temperature, temperature in Celsius, right. So this will just, uh, the user is going to enter the temperature in Celsius over here. And what I will simply do is I will just store this inside a variable name Celsius, okay. And again, I will just do a type conversion over here and I will just make this as float over here, okay. And once done with this, now I just want to apply this formula over here. So what I will simply do is I will just say Celsius and uh, multiply by 
1.8 and I will just store this uh, put this inside a bracket and I will just do plus 32 okay so this will be my Fahrenheit over here okay so I'm just going to say this this is going to be my fine and once done with this now what I need to do is I need to just print the message over here okay so I'm just going to say the is and after this I'm just going to uh, uh, the uh, the result would be stored inside this variable that is this Fahrenheit over here all right and I'm just going to run this thing okay so I'm just going to take the same example so let me just copy this okay so I'm just going to take the same example over here so it should give me this 71.6 okay so I'm just going to run this thing and you can see that I got the exactly the same result that is 71.6 over here so this is how we have achieved our goal of converting uh, the temperature uh, from Celsius to Fahrenheit and from Fahrenheit to Celsius over here okay so you can even do it this way also that uh, if you just want that uh, it's up to the user like you want to give the user a choice that uh, uh, what you need to do whether you need to convert it from Celsius to Fahrenheit or Fahrenheit to Celsius you want to give the user the choice and you want to run your code as per the uh, choice given by the user so you can do it that way also so what I will simply do is I will just uh, uh, uncomment this okay and see this this, uh, this code we have written for like uh, in order to convert this Fahrenheit to the Celsius over here so I will just call this as Celsius over here so let me just copy this thing okay so this is my method so I'm creating a method called Celsius over here and I will just put this inside this so I'm just commenting uh, I'm just uh, uh, giving a tab over here okay so this is uh, the code for my Celsius over here and similarly I'm just going to copy this thing and what I will simply do is I will create another method over here by the name of Fahrenheit because this is give, going to give me the result in Fahrenheit okay by accepting the Celsius input and once done with this so I have created these two methods over here and at the end what I will simply do is I will just create one more method okay so I'm just going to create main over here and what I need to do is I need to just display a menu type like uh, what you need to do so I'm just uh, taking this print and I'm just uh, gonna uh, say that uh, uh, the number one option is uh, to convert in Celsius right and the second one is so I'm just this this statement is just gonna display it okay it would be a menu type like uh, for the user and after this I need to just say that uh, uh, I need to accept uh, the choice from the user so I'm just taking the input so I'm just saying that enter the choice okay and i will just put this inside a variable name so i will just say that let this be a choice over here and if a uh, user says that if my choice okay so if the choice equal to equal to it's one all right so what i need to do is i will just put this inside a bracket over here what i'm simply doing is that if the choice is equal to equal to one over here so you need to call this uh, uh, because it is to convert this into Celsius okay and this will just convert it into Celsius okay so I'm just going to call this method okay so I'm just putting that thing so this is my Celsius method over here okay the next thing over here is that I'm just giving this elif condition over, over here so elif the choice is equal to equal to 2 over here so what you need to do is I'm just going to call this Fahrenheit over here and at the end at the else if the users uh, apart from this choices one and two if the users enter something different so i'm just uh, going to print that it's an invalid choice okay it's uh and once done with this okay so i have created this uh, uh, uh method over here all right and now what i need to do is i need to just call this thing okay and in order to call that thing i need to come up over here and out, outside the loop i'm just calling this main over here and now if I just run this thing over here so you can see that I'm getting this menu type okay so it depends upon the user that what it wants to do so it, uh, suppose that I just enter this as one so I just want to convert uh, in Celsius okay so when I just say one so you can see that it says that enter the temperature in Fahrenheit all right so I'm just going to come up over here and let's say that I'm giving this 32 over here so I should get zero all right so I'm just entering this 32 over here and you can see that I got this the temperature in Celsius is zero all right similarly i can just run this thing once again and this time i'm just going to say to convert it into fahrenheit over here so i'm uh, uh, entering the choice as two over here it says that enter the temperature in celsius so let's enter zero over here and you can see that i got this temperature in fahrenheit that is 32.0 over here so this is how uh, we have achieved like uh, 
you can just uh, understand this thing okay so just uh, do it step by step over here uh, the uh, the important thing over here is just uh, this formula over here so i have just applied this formula so what i have done over here is that i just uh, in order to just convert this uh, uh, fahrenheit to the celsius over here we have this formula over here and in order to just convert your uh, the your celsius to fahrenheit over here so we have this formula over here so i've created a method over here okay uh, that is a function over here by the name the celsius and fahrenheit and inside this main function what i did i just displayed this menu over here and took the input from the user as a choice and depending upon this choice if the user enters one over here so the celsius method would be called and if the user enters this two uh, choice over here so fahrenheit method would be called okay and if apart from this if i just run over here once again and if i just enter here four over here so you are seeing that it says that it's an invalid choice over here all right so i hope that you have understood with this logic over here okay so if you just like this video so hit the like buttons share it to your friends and do subscribe to our channel and see you in the next video